How to Remove a Shared Calendar from Outlook View Have you ever found yourself overwhelmed by too many calendars in Outlook? If you are looking to simplify your view by removing a shared calendar, you are in the right place. Let's break down the steps to help you clear up your calendar space. First, it is important to understand what a shared calendar is. A shared calendar in Outlook is one that someone else has made accessible to you. This means you can view their schedule alongside your own. However, if you no longer need to see that calendar, removing it is a simple process. If you are using the Outlook desktop application, start by opening Outlook and navigating to the calendar section. In the left pane, you will see a list of calendars. Locate the shared calendar you wish to remove. Right-click on the name of that calendar. You will see a context menu pop up. From there, select Delete Calendar or Delete Group, depending on how the calendar is categorized. Outlook will then prompt you to confirm the removal. Click Yes, and the shared calendar will be removed from your calendar list. It will be moved to the Deleted Items folder, but the original calendar remains intact for the owner and other users. If you are using Outlook on the web, the process is quite similar. Sign into your Outlook account and click on the calendar icon. In the left calendar list, find the shared calendar you want to remove. Right, click on it and select Delete Calendar if that option is available. Confirm the removal and you are all set. For those using the Outlook mobile application on either iOS or Android, the steps are just as easy. Open the Outlook app and go to the calendar section. Tap the menu button, which usually appears as three horizontal lines in the top left corner. Find the shared calendar you want to remove and tap the gear icon next to it. From there, select Remove Shared Calendar, and it will be removed from your view. Keep in mind that removing a shared calendar only affects your view. The original calendar remains unchanged for the owner and other users. If you ever need to add the shared calendar back, you can do so at any time. If you encounter any issues, such as a cannot open calendar error, it may be due to permission restrictions or the owner no longer being part of your organization. In such cases, you may need to remove it through the delete option or adjust permissions. Now you have the steps to remove a shared calendar from your Outlook view, whether you are using the desktop app, the web version, or the mobile app. Enjoy a cleaner calendar experience.